Hi, this is Priyanshu. In today's video, we are going to talk about our eighth class, physics. That's the second chapter, friction. Okay. So in this chapter, we are going to see the keywords and question answer and whatever the multiple choice questions and the project work, activities, experiment, whatever it is in this particular chapter, we are going to see the everything in this one. Okay. So do one thing, take your test book and uh, keep it in your front of you whenever you get out you can match with your test book okay right so let's just start with our first keywords so these are the keywords here the eight keywords are given like uh, mm, friction okay so actually this is a pencil okay like that you can see here friction aesthetic frictions sliding frictions lubricants rolling friction ball wearing drag fluid friction okay so this is the eight keywords which is present in your test book uh, if you have a test book then you can look at this these are the keywords which is only in your test book okay after that if it is clear then i will go to the uh, that's the reflection on concept actually these are a question answer so the first question is that explain the type of friction with a suitable examples okay and this is the examples like uh, static friction sliding frictions rolling frictions okay and if it is clear then I will go to the second question. A book placed on a surface on a table. The book is probably uh, pushed uh, in on the direction. Draw a force acting on the table and explain. Actually, you have to draw the uh, one diagram also so you can draw it. Uh, otherwise, no need to be that. You can just write like that. Okay. Right. So I will go to the third question. Give few examples of sliding friction. Okay, what is the different? Uh, what is the? Uh, you have to give the some example of sliding friction. Like we, when we slide in your, if you study, then in your school also we roll our pencil under branches sometimes. So this is only a sliding friction. Okay, otherwise, we, uh, when we come from the our like uh, uh, in our school there is uh, something uh, steps which is very plain like a sliding. So we slide on that. Okay, so these are the very general examples. Okay explain how does the lubricant reduce friction okay how does the lubricant reduce frictions okay now explain with a one example that frictional force is proportional to the normal force okay these are the fifth answer you can say that and if it is clear then i will go to the application of concept okay this is a very important application of concept here you can see and in that you in that particular question the first question is that explain why is the sport men's use uh, shoes with uh, uh, with uh, spikes uh, spikes means like uh, something uh, very sharp knees type which is present in their shoes okay uh, and that's a particular answer what is it easier or difficult for you to walk in marble floored with a soapy water it is dif it is it is difficult you will sleep on that okay now what happen if you do not reduce friction in machine okay if you don't re reduce friction in machine what will happen it will break down otherwise it uh, like if you take the fan or any machine if if you not reduce the friction it will break down totally okay now right so let's go to the fourth question the fourth question is that what purpose are surveyed by using ball ringing in machines explain with the daily life examples okay now is it clear like fifth one draw a free body diagram fbd what is the mean by the fbd remember it will ask you in your exam what is the mean by fbd okay always say free body diagram okay right so that's the fifth question and generally this is the answer of that okay is it clear right i will go to the high other question high other thinking questions so the first question is that do you agree with the statement friction is a both good and evil good and evil yeah it is i i believe if if in a machine if in a particular machine if the friction is not there uh, like if you if you see that then it is very evil to you and when you are walking or sliding on ice or uh, like any surface which is very smooth if there is a no friction then you know what will happen if there is a friction then it, it is good for you if it is not friction then it is evil okay na? right so you can see here good useful in friction and bad harmful friction actually you know uh, this question will be also asked in the lot of time in the 11th class of the physics in physics in intermediate it is asked what is the advantage and disadvantage of the friction how the friction is uh, good and how it is bad it is asked in the 11th class of uh, physics also in our TZ or you can say Telangana state what TZ means okay na? right 
reducing friction to the lowest possible level machines tools and so this is a, our two, second one of that you can read about that and then after that i will move to the multiple choice question okay these are the multiple choice question actually here these are the questions and that's the particular answer you can look at that and in this one this is correct here we already given in third one the d1 is correct in fourth one this v1 is correct okay after that we will move to the suggested experiment and this is the experiment which is suggested to you like conduct an experiment understand the nature of frictions of any con uh, concept of a static frictions to conduct an experiment to find out the effects of the roses on frictional forces so these are the two and answer is there you can look at and this is a project work and here this is first project work this is a proper answer and this is the second one collect the information about the substance using to reduce the frictions in the different machines in a prepare a report on it a report on it and this is the report well i think this chapter is ended here okay right so this chapter is totally completed here in this chapter whatever the question and so everything is completed and if you have any kinds of doubt you can match with your textbook i hope this video is going to be very helpful for you and if you're looking for the other subjects also question answered so you can just go to our channel click on the playlist and you will find the uh, lots of type of subjects question answer there okay i hope this video is going to be helpful to you and we will meet in the next video jai hind